Okay, so this is my May Costco haul. This is May 5th, and we took the kids to their senior prom and dropped them off. And while we were in town waiting to go pick them back up, we went shopping. So this is what we picked up at Costco. Um, we got this ready to hang shade sale. Um, if you can see on the picture, it's 13 feet by 7 feet. And what we're going to use it for is for over the duck coop so that they have shade this summer. Uh, we've been using tarps in the past and the tarps just get blown in the wind and destroyed so this I think will work better um, because that's what it's actually for and um, it will let the rain through so that it doesn't have a big puddle in the middle because that's part of the reason why the tarps get torn up. So this was like $24 or something like that but we saw them last year and didn't do it, and I've been kicking myself ever since. And so I told Scott this year we are getting one of those, and hopefully it will last us quite a while and uh, do what we want it to do. Then I picked up some of these dark chocolate graham clusters with almonds. I've never tried these before, but they looked really good, and there's no milk in them, so that's always a plus for me. <laughs> Then I picked up some more of these late July jalapeno lime chips. These are delicious. Love these. Buy them quite often from Costco. And then I also got some of the organic tortilla chips that we get every time. That's just something we always get. Um, I needed some more avocado oil. And I've been looking at it in the regular stores and like at Walmart and things. And you just cannot beat the price at Costco. It's just... It's just... I just kept passing it up at Walmart because it's like, I know I can get that cheaper at Costco. So we picked up some of that. And I like avocado oil because it has a higher smoke point. So if you're going to be cooking something at a higher temperature, you can use avocado oil. So that's what I use it for. I eat a lot of cinnamon, and I was out of cinnamon. And so I picked this up. Well, I'm not completely out. I was getting low, put it that way. And this big bottle is just a little over $2 at Costco, so can't beat that. Um, we go through a lot of garlic salt in our house. It's one of our favorite seasonings, so I picked up some more of that. I got this big bag of sweet potatoes. Oh, how many pounds? Um, I can't see on here how many pounds it is. But um, I like sweet potatoes, and it was a really good deal, so I picked up some sweet potatoes. I picked up this big bag of baby red potatoes. I love these, um, like new potatoes. I just love them. Um, I picked up these um, Nitro gloves, 200 pair. <laughs> um, four, yeah, 400 gloves, so that would be 200 pair. We use gloves for everything around here. Um, Scott uses them when he's working outside, doing, you know, stuff on the car and doesn't want to get grease on his hands. I use them when I'm, you know, making meatloaf or touching raw meat. And so we just decided to finally break down and just buy them in bulk. And this was um, $19.99, so $20. $20. What does that dog have to bark at at 11 o'clock at night? Hold on, let me make her stop. You would think at 11 o'clock at night that I would have be able to do a haul without those dogs barking. <laughs> oh. Okay, so then I picked up this um, six pack of organic pasta. I love it. I get this often. We got another thing of the LaCroix sparkling water. Um, we really like it. Um, the passion fruit is a really, really good, and the coconut tastes good if you add a little bit of lime to it. Um, it's just, they're really good. There's no calories, no artificial sweeteners, no sodium. They're just really good. And then the last thing we got, I believe, at Costco was two cases of water, and those are for the kids' graduation party. We're going to make lemonade in a big um, cooler, and then they're going to have bottled water, and that's what the, they're going to have to drink. 
So that is everything that we picked up at Costco. And also while we were in town today, we went to Gordon's Food Service. Never been there before, but we knew we could get paper products and stuff like that for the kids' graduation party there. So we picked up paper plates. We are planning for 100 people. Um, Scott thinks that won't, that won't be that. Ugh, I'm tongue-tied. Scott thinks that I'm planning for too many, but I would rather have leftovers and, you know, plan for too many and uh, have leftovers than not have enough or run out of something. So we got these foam plates, 125 count from Glenn's Food Service. We got four bags of chips. Um, we got two of the Ripple and two of the Ripple barbecue. And I know those chips will not go to waste. If there's any left, my family will eat them. That is for sure. Then we picked up some cups. This is for the lemonade. There was, this is a 57 count, so we got two of those. And then I picked up these little um, portion cups. They're two ounce portion cups um, because we are having a candy station where um, there's going to be like apothecary jars with candy in them and and like the metal scoops and then that way people can just scoop up a little serving of candy so I got these and they came in a 200 count so I know we're gonna have plenty of these left and Scott had a really good idea he said go ahead and get the lids because that way whatever cups are left we can actually use them to put like salad dressings and that kind of stuff in and we wouldn't use them if we didn't have lids so we're not going to use the lids for the party but we will use them for whatever of these cups that are left over so that is everything we picked up at Costco and at Gordon's food service so thanks a lot for watching my haul hope you enjoyed it and if you haven't subscribed please hit that subscribe button we'll talk to you later bye friends